But my brain tells me I've been here before Don't wanna draw any attention To all the crazy things that I shouldn't mention North Korea's missile launch on Wednesday Now confirmed to be their most sophisticated to date Defense officials from the U.S. and South Korea confirming the missile was an ICBM capable of delivering a 2,200-pound payload to virtually any point in the continental United States. If it were fired at a normal angle, it would be capable of flying over 8,000 miles. That means it can reach Washington, D.C. And on Friday, signs emerged that another test could be underway soon with the construction of a new launch pad. It's a big step forward for the North Korean military, which has pressed on with its missile and nuclear programs despite the Trump administration's attempts to isolate the North diplomatically and economically. That maximum pressure campaign is our top uh, national security priority here. Uh, nations continue to get on board and support that. If North Korea does launch against the U.S., one likely target is Hawaii. Officials there taking the threat seriously, testing a newly revamped air raid warning system on Friday. <coughs> Tourists and residents say they think it's a good idea, given the unpredictability of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. He seems somewhat inst unstable, and uh, because of that, I think precautions should be taken. It's concerning. I feel a little bit like it's, it's out of my hands. South Korean officials say at the rate that they are progressing, North Korea could have a viable arsenal of nuclear missiles ready by the middle of next year. In London, Greg Falcon.